Hey everybody. Although I like Windows 10, one of the biggest things I absolutely cannot stand about it is the fact that it likes to force updates on you. Rather than allow you to choose when to download and install updates, it automatically searches for updates and installs them for you. Whether they're good updates or they're bad updates. Well, for example, um, this Dell laptop here. I did a clean install of Windows 10 on it back in, I guess, April or May. Earlier, it was earlier this year. Um, brand new laptop, fresh out of the box. I did a wipe and reload on it and configured Windows 10 exactly the way the client wanted it. And, of course, it's Windows 10 Home. So, there's no getting around Windows Update. It's, you're, you're, you're just, you just have, you're forced to suffer through it. And guess what, guys? This laptop took a bad update. Watch what happens here. It tries to boot up. And it crashes. This is critical process died. So the client explains that the machine no longer boots after they went to install updates. Rendering the machine useless. So from this point you essentially get a boot loop into automatic repair which can't do squat for it. Um, so at that point you're pretty much screwed. Um, so this is not the only instance I've seen recently. Um, this was the first instance, however, at the place that I work, um, they started deploying Windows 10 back in the summer, I guess. So they have quite a few um, computers on the domain with Windows 10 now. And quite a few of those got bad updates today and they no longer boot. Some of them reverted to like a factory reset and it resulted in a clean installation of Windows 10 lacking all of the software that was included in the system image including the Altair supplement agent making re-imaging a little more um, of a hassle. So yeah, the, all those machines had to be re-imaged because of a stupid Windows 10 update. Now see the thing is I don't know exactly which updates causing their problem um, because when you go look on Google you get all sorts of different articles from various dates of various updates that caused issues with boot failure and such. So it's like okay which one's causing our problem? So anyways that's my quick little um, fuss about Windows 10's um, method of installing updates in the case that this machine here no longer boots so now I'm going to have to pull the hard drive out recover the, the client's files put the hard drive back in and reload Windows on it it's amazing laptop's only been used for about five or six months and it's already in for service due to a flawed Windows update that um, that crashed the system essentially don't you just love it Windows 10 anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video thanks for watching Hey everybody, I sure hope you guys enjoyed this video from Q Computer Channel. Remember to like the video, subscribe to Q Computer Channel for more updates, and remember to tick the bell so that you actually get notified of these updates. Did you know that I am also on a second channel that's CubeCop MTDX? Over there you'll find videos of bicycling, weather, elevators, and all sorts of other neat and interesting stuff. Feel free to subscribe to that channel as well. And again, I thank you for your support. And thanks for watching this video.